What is up guys? Welcome back to the DVD Collector. I am here at my local Savers. We're looking at some DVDs for a decent price and uh, actually no, the prices have gone up which is not that fun or cool because they're probably not going to sell as much. But we are here looking through some movies and yeah, I actually already did a voiceover of this entire thing but something failed on my end and I went back to go look at the audio <laughs> and it didn't record everything so it only recorded the first five minutes so I don't know how long I'm gonna last doing a voiceover to this one but anyways I like to do the voiceovers because when I'm there I get a little anxious and I don't like talking to the camera and there's also music playing in the background which always messes with my uploading. I'm always getting hit by copyright claims and this and that and strikes. So anyways, we are gonna just continue to do the voiceover stuff. There's some sections in here where the audio will be in the background and that's cool because there wasn't music playing. But um, yeah, so t today I hit up uh, Savers, Salvation Army, and Big Lots. So my big three kind of go searching and hunting for movies places and I honestly, I haven't been picking up too much because a lot of the stuff that I'm coming across, A, I either have already, or B, um, they're just, it's just too expensive, you know what I mean? I just can't have everything. And I really just kind of, I've mentioned this in my previous videos, I really have been just curating my collection because I'm in a spot now where I have a lot of, well, they have all those Elvis movies, it's cool. But I'm kind of in a spot now where I have everything that I really want, and it's getting harder to me, for me to find out, like Lonesome Dove, I love that, I have that already. Um, it's getting harder for me to find new stuff that I feel is tangible that I want to have in my collection. And, um... Yeah, like, I have Harry Potter. I have, like, that on everything. I have Harry Potter on DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K now. Like, jeez. And I have a special box sets. Not all of them, but most of them. This is kind of cool. Look at that. What is that? That's... Yeah, I don't know. That's cool. Um, a lot of... Oh, that was heavy, though. A lot of DVDs and that. But, yeah, I've been just kind of looking for... Like, today I've been looking for Cars too. My wife and I have been watching Cars. Um, we rewatched. Oh, Mystic Pizza. My friend's actually borrowing my copy of Mystic Pizza. Hope I get it back. <laughs> we all know how that goes. But my wife and I have been rewatching. Well, she never saw Cars. So I'm rewatching Cars. She's never seen it. She watched the first and the third one with me, but we didn't watch the second because I can't find the second anywhere on DVD or Blu ray. And I kind of want to find it. I don't want to have to like, spend $10 for it. A, because it wasn't the best Cars movie, in my opinion. I liked Cars 1 and 3 was pretty good, but Cars 3 was a little slow at the beginning, so it took me a couple times to actually watch it all the way through. And when I did, I watched it all the way through my wife recently, I was like, wow, Cars 3 is actually pretty good. But yeah, I, I, Cars 2, I just I don't really remember too much about it. I think they went overseas and like did some circuit racing like in Japan, maybe. Or I might be thinking of Tokyo Drift, I don't even know. But <laughs> there's Cars 1, as you can see. I have that on Blu-ray and DVD. And I've been just trying to give the DVD away, but nobody wants it. For into that issue. Uh, but I, yeah, I upgraded. And then there's Finding Dory. Like, I already have that. That wasn't even the best. Finding Nemo was way better. But I have that. So a lot of stuff that I see, it's just... I, I don't know. I, I might have to go do, like, boutique stuff. Like, I might have to go look for movies that I've just never seen. Or, I don't know. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do. It's also financially becoming really expensive to buy more expensive movies, I guess. And then, like I said, Savers isn't really that cheap anymore. Like, $10 for a PlayStation 3 game, you know, that's been out for forever. You know what I mean? That should be, like, 2 bucks, maybe 3 But then again, everything's inflated. Um, yeah, and I played those games already. I already played those. Played Liberty City, or, what am I saying? Um... The Lost and Damned. The Ballad of Gay Tony. I already played those. Um, and I also noticed this Savers doesn't really do... Like, I have that copy of Scarface. I've been trying to give that away. Nobody wants it. So, I'm just going to have to start donating stuff. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, like, Savers doesn't... They used to do deals like where purple tags would be 
fifty percent off or yellow tags would be fifty percent off. I don't see those sales anymore. Like when I come in here, like either I'm going the wrong days, but I've gone during the week, I've gone during the weekend, they just don't see those deals. Like sometimes they'll be like, Okay, well media is thirty percent off but then you have to have like a savers coupon or you have to use a QR code and it's just like kinda of confusing and sometimes I just don't feel like having to think. <laughs> I mean I just wanna get what I want and get out. Uh, especially this savers. This one's a really busy one on the especially on the weekends. That's asses to elbows in there. <laughs> like it's the way it is. Um, category seven, very cool. I will check and see if my audio is still recording. If not, I'm just gonna give up on this entirely. It's still going. It's uh, struggle lugging along. I don't know why. It's kind of. I hope the quality's not bad. Jeez. All right. So you guys know how I like to do things. I like to have like a raw video. I don't like to chop it up. I just like to go and show you guys what I see. I don't see too many, like, there's some other YouTube YouTubers that do that. Um, there was one guy I used to watch, but he stopped making videos, and his videos were like this. And his name is The the Board Cyborg. I'll give him a shout-out. Go check him out. The Board Cyborg. That guy motivated me to do this stuff. That and Flea Market Falcon. If you guys are watching this, you guys are the reason I really started this channel, because I liked how you guys would go out, especially The Board Cyborg. He would go and literally just... He wouldn't even do voiceovers or anything like that. He would just go out and he'd be like, "Oh, look at this movie! Like, oh, I already have that. Oh, I don't want this. Oh, look at that!" And he would he would post it, and I was that I love that raw content. Like I said, I would do the same, but these places usually jack up the music, and I can't even hear myself think sometimes, and I get hit by copyright issues, and I just don't want like strikes against my channel or whatever. But um, yeah, I like to give you guys that raw content so you can see everything. You know, I don't know. You might have a savers that's completely different. You know, different vibe. I've been to different ones, and you, you do see a lot of the same stuff, but you don't know what's gonna come through those doors. You don't know what people are gonna donate. They might be sitting on, you know, some random obscure movies that could be. It could be a gold mine. I don't know. So that's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for those those movies that I'm like, oh wow, holy crap, they never put this on Blu-ray, but here it is. Like, you, like I found Dogma. That was one of on my list. I couldn't find anywhere an apocalypto movies like that i couldn't find those anywhere but when i did i had them and i was able to just <laughs> snag them up and now i have them in the collection forever for as long as those discs work i can watch it i don't have to go on netflix and worry about things getting taken down you know it's like i love it and that's that's why i'm so passionate and that's why i want to share with you guys these movies like the, what I find, and I love I love hearing what you guys find. I love the comments, and what you guys are saying. Oh, check this out! Check that out! It's awesome. So what a great way we have this YouTube. We can share. We can we can tell each other. You know, hey, this is what I found where I live, and this is what what uh, you know what I've come across for this price. And it, it's just it's such an awesome community, guys. Like it's not a big community, but it's awesome, tight knit, and everybody's so positive. You know, sometimes you get people that say some pretty nasty stuff, but they're very few and far in between. Far and few between. I don't know. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> but, um, yeah, sorry. I'm just going on kind of like a little rant. Didn't expect that today. But, um, yeah, now we're at Salvation Army. This one, I can't play the audio whatsoever because they have a speaker right above me. And it's just blasting music. Blasting it. So, we can see you got some Blu-rays here. Planet 51. That was a guy. I saw that once. Don't need to really see it again. You get pandas. I don't know. That's on 4K. That's cool. But I, I, I don't know if I'm gonna sit there and watch pandas all day. Um, might be a fun one-time watch. If you, didn't, you know, whatever. So we got Superman. That's cool. That's always fun to have. Um, yeah. Yep. Very cool. All right. So. Anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to let you guys just enjoy watching what we have. Hey, this stuff is just slow and driven. Hey, hey. Uh, then we got Billy Madison. Uh, so, But I'm going to go ahead and let you guys enjoy the rest of this video without me ranting in the background. And like I said, if you guys are new here and you like videos like this, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If not... That's fine. And if you like the video, if you give me a thumbs up, that's even better. It helps me out. helps out the channel and helps other people come across this type of content if they enjoy it. That's great. You know, I just, at the end of the day, I just like going out there and sharing what I can find. And I have the skills to at least 
use my phone or whatever GoPro sometimes I, I take out and I just record. I just like to record what I find and show you guys what's out there. And it's uh, very meaningful and, and it keeps me busy. It, it, it helps me share my hobby rather than just keep it to myself. And at the end of the day, it is fun to watch movies. I've always loved watching movies. It's it's a way I can kind of, it's a form of escapism for me. I, we can escape this uh, uh, anti-Italianism. What's that all about? I'm mostly Italian, so I take offense. Hey, hey. But um, at the end of the day, it's it's uh, I can visit these different worlds and get away from reality because the world sometimes isn't so, you know, there are there's a lot of good in it, a lot more good than bad, but sometimes all you hear is that negativity on the news and, I try to just, you know, not be arrogant, and like, I like to know what's going on, but... <sighs> Brokeback Mountain, oh, jeez. Uh, it's a good movie, I just don't swing that way. But um, what I'm trying to say here is there's a lot of negativity, and, and, you know, if you could try to focus on the positivity, you know, that's... That's, you know, what life's all about, is just trying to be positive and love one another and, and um, you know, treat people the way you want to be treated. It's very simple. Um... But anyways, I think I'm kind of going off <laughs> off the rails a little bit. Um, but yeah, being able to share this stuff with you guys is so fun. And getting to learn about other movies is just so much fun. And um, I probably should have picked that up. It looked like a cool thriller for movies for one for a dollar fifty. Jeez, Psh, what am I doing? <laughs> but what Nightmare, Nightmare on Elm Street. I already have the Blu-rays, so don't need that. But that would be a fun find for somebody who just wants the first movie. And, um, yeah, so like I said, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you watch the rest of this video, and if not, uh, thank you for making it this far.